Hey guys, Mark here from Mission Bow Care. Today we're talking about the hex mat and how you're gonna manage this when you're out on the water. So this is a big mat and it might seem a little intimidating at first, but with a little bit of technique, it's actually very manageable to get this in the bag while you're out on the water. I'm using our little 12 volt pump to suck most of the air out of this mat. It's a great little pump, plugs right into your cigarette lighter adapter. We wanna make sure here we're actually leaving enough air in the mat so that it will float on top of the water. If this starts to sink on you, it just becomes a lot harder to do. So once I've got this thing floating in the water, we're gonna start folding this up. And the important part here is to make sure that we're not folding the valve into the mat. We wanna leave that exposed when we roll this up at the end. So I'm gonna do a total of five folds two on each side, and then one right down the middle. And that's gonna create that nice long shape that I'm gonna to use to pull up into the boat when I do our flat fold. You can see the air in the mat here is holding it up above the water. So here we're gonna start to do our what we call our flat fold. So I'm gonna take about 12 inches of mat, I'm gonna fold it over, and then I'm gonna fold it flat again. And I'm just going to keep doing that, repeating that and pulling that up into the boat until I've got a nice tight bundle. When I get towards the end, you can see it'll start to pillow up a little bit. And that's the air that's left in the mat. And that's what was keeping up on top of the water. So I'm just going to go in, open up the valve, release that air. When I do my final folds here, it'll squeeze all that air out of the mat. And then I'll be ready to go ahead and put it in the bag. So a little bit of tidiness can go a long ways when you're folding this up, but it doesn't have to be perfect. There's uh, plenty of room in the bag to get this mat in. Um, with a little bit of practice and these techniques, you shouldn't have any problem managing this mat when you're out on the water. If you have any other questions, feel free to give us a call. We're here to help.